So I always want to go to the world's biggest beer festival which happens annually in Munich, Germany. But this is Canada. Let's go to Germany. Are we still in Toronto? But you know what? We are going to enjoy Oktoberfest right here in Canada. We don't even have to go to Germany. It's happening right here in Ontario Place. So yeah, when I got to know Oktoberfest was happening here in Toronto, I had to get the tickets for it. I always had a fascination with attending this fest because it looked so much fun in the pictures and I was super pumped. So let's go and check it out together what it's all about. So it was a three day event with time slots for every day and we chose 12 to 4 and paid $40 per ticket. Hello, Hi guys. This is one. Okay. This is two. I think I scanned that one. Yeah. Okay. So they're going to give you a wristband and like so the first 500 people were supposed to get the free beer style and we are among the first 500. And I'm all excited to fill this huge cup right here which is actually called the Stein. Wow, this is the first time I'm holding this. I'm so excited. Let's go. So the first stop is obviously going to be beer. So let's fill this up. Obviously, German beer. Oktoberfest wheat beer which is super yum and you've got a seat here. This is the first experience of Oktoberfest in Toronto. Yes. Mm. So difficult to hold and it's 10 bucks for half time and the beer is actually really good. This is the wheat beer that I'm having which is exclusively for Oktoberfest right from Germany. This is too good. And this is my first time attending Oktoberfest and I'm really excited. It's such a lively atmosphere here. People are even dressed up in their German Oktoberfest attire. Totally Bavarian theme here. And I'm really excited to see what's next. We were the first few ones to enter this place. So you can well understand my craziness to attend Oktoberfest here. Oh, look at him. Hey, how are you? Good to see you. <laughs> Octoberfest is here again. Bring your family and your friends and join in on the fun. I'm posing, I'm posing, get a good The best part the people of all age groups, people of our age, people who are old, and also people with. Families, so I think this is the perfect event to attend next year if you're in Toronto because by the time this video goes up, this will be over. It's only like a three day event here. Tiki Taka, Tiki Taka. So it wasn't just about the beer, but there were so many performances. The first one, all the traditional dancing. also in Toronto. Okay, time for another round of beer. So I'm going to get tokens. Excuse me, can I get two tokens for you? You wanna say hi? Let's go for the round. Yep, let's go. Oh, these are massive glasses of beer. snacks now and I see pretzels and also beer nuts. I think we should grab one.
sit there and work it by. can't miss this performance, it was definitely my favourite. Excuse me? In your phone, I see my own reflection. Is that sexy foul line a really you better believe it, Shanti! So, go, so, days, my friend, they got me hell for him. I'm singing and dance forever. T22, I love you, Toronto! I honestly had zero expectations when I came here but I had no clue that it would be so much fun if you are from Germany please comment down below I love you for creating this amazing festival that we have here so right now we are enjoying all the performances look at this Amazing. Next year, I want to dress like them. Let's see who wins. Make some noise for our first couple here. Make some noise for our regular Our couple in teal yeah. All right, I think we're going with the couple in teal. I'm ready for another round. Are you? Yes, this is our third class. The beer is so yummy. We can't resist. We want to have more. So guys, I just met someone. You got to meet this guy because he knows more India than me. So. Yeah! 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 Cheers! Yeah, okay. What's this is, this what do you question. know about India? India is the best. <laughs> Ras Malai, Bakora, dancing. I love everything. I love India. They told me I have the Punjab essence. Okay? Yeah. And where are you originally from? From you Brampton. Born here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm born here. Oh, yeah. wow. That's so cool. See, this place is so like multicultural. People are here from everywhere in the world. That's the best part about Canada, to be honest. And now, let's eat. Enough of drinking. I want a hot dog and a sausage. German sausage right here. You should really see how we close this party. And it's not over yet. Wait for it. This will revive you, Rufus. Rufus. No, there's no one dying on stage tonight. Not on my watch. Rufus. 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 Rufus.
What do we have here? More food trucks? Yeah, there's tons of food here. There's a poutine food truck, but we won't have poutine. That's for Christmas market. Okay. Yeah. Move forward. What do we have? Another poutine? That's routine. Yeah. But what's routine? Let's ask them. I have a question. What's the difference between poutine and tipine? It's just like a poutine with the potato sauce. Oh, taters. It's okay, like so the fries and the taters. Okay, so if it's taters, it's tipine. But if it's fries, it's poutine. Yeah. I learned to be a poutine. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> so guys, we also have washrooms here. Look at this. So many. They're all portable washrooms. So even if you have lots of beer, you know where to take it all out. Right here. So that's where I'm going. I'll see you later. Guys, this is our first October fest. So we're gonna take these home as a souvenir. And I'm gonna wash these. So this is gonna be our first memory for October Fest in Toronto. Yes! Okay, so October Fest wasn't really a beer festival when it was celebrated in 80s or 1880s. I don't know, sorry guys. But yeah, it was kind of a celebration, like a wedding celebration for Prince. But now, it's a beer festival. We saw a lot of culture, like a German yeah. culture. And I think this is one tradition that I really want to Keep up with. Highly recommend. Right? Yes. Yeah. I promise it's going to be one hell of a time. It's just the vibe, you know, everybody's so positive. I just got to know from a local the best one is in Kitchener than Toronto. So Next year we'll meet you guys in Kitchener. 2023, October Fest, Kitchener it is. So hungry right now. But look at people right now, they're having fun. So the way people entered this place, they did not come out the same way. Yes, it gets really crazy in the end. So whenever you go, drink responsibly. I want to eat schedule. Have it. They're done, they're over. Are you going to serve it? No. Close up. It's closed. Yes. <laughs> Prosta. Prosta. Prosta? I don't know. Prosta. Pros. Pros. I don't know. Guys, if you're coming to Octoberfest, have all food. this food. Are you closed? Oh, okay. That's what happens when you have a lot of beer. You miss all the food. Ah, we are back. Gosh, this was so much fun. This was such an amazing festival. If you're in Toronto, in Canada, you have to visit here. Maybe next year because if you can't go to Germany like me, we have all of this in Canada. The best thing about Canada is it's so multicultural that you have all kind of celebrations from all over the world. I'm just very appreciative of this country right now. Toronto, I love you. In Canada, I love you. And if you guys love me, please do hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.